I'm Chris Devin. Right now I'm joined by our newest Boston Power player, Austin Partain from Century 21, Abigail Adams. Austin, welcome to the team. Hey, thanks for having me. I really appreciate it. Now you're out of the Quincy market. And yes. from what I understand, it's red hot right now. It's crazy. It's wonderful. It's a good thing. <laughs> it's a good place to be. A lot of people are coming out because the city is red hot as well. Yes. But I feel like a lot of people are starting to look south. Yeah, the demographics in Quincy have certainly changed in the last couple of years. We have a lot of young first-time home buyers coming to the city. Um, I think it's going to be the new south with all the development going on. They're really adding a lot to the city. So, yes, yeah, certainly over the last couple of years, we've had a much younger population coming to, to Quincy. And, it's, you know, it's a great location. It's certainly convenient to the city. Um, for those professionals so and getting from Quincy to downtown Boston you can do it in under 30 minutes yeah you can um, and again we have four train stops so it's easy in fact I had a buyer call me the other day and they were like well we're looking at Quincy we want to try and keep under a $30 uber ride <laughs> I was like that's perfect <laughs> you know it is it, you know it's a great location it's an easy commute whether it is a uber ride a drive or the train it's funny how the questions are definitely yeah. changing. <laughs> Uber is coming into real estate. Yeah. Uh, in regards to new construction, I understand that there's a lot going on in the downtown as well. Yeah, they're really, you know, Quincy used to be called Shoppers Town USA. The Braintree Mall came in and kind of sucked all of that out of Quincy. So lately, in the last five years, they've really been focused on bringing that back to Quincy. So right now we have tons of apartments coming in, commercial space, restaurants, shopping, uh, hotels. I mean, it's phenomenal what's going on downtown. It looks like a construction site all over the place. But, um, you know, they're, they're getting down to the, the end point here. So. And from a real estate side, um, price point is definitely more reasonable than other parts of the city. Certainly. I mean, you know, Southie and even Dorchester, um, you know, prices have skyrocketed. And people can't afford that. You know, they, they want more. They want a bigger bang for their buck. And that's why they're coming to Quincy. And certainly we've seen values increase, too, because the demand is overwhelming. But still, when you compare it to those city markets, you're getting an excellent value. And it's just as easy to get to the city. Definite value yeah. down in Quincy. Thank you, Austin. Yeah. And if you're looking for great value and still looking for that city feel, Quincy is a great option. You can reach out to Austin directly by going to austinpartain.com. And remember, we have more market updates right here on our page on boston.com.